Imagine you are looking for hair fall control shampoo. By looking online, say on Amazon, you come across a shampoo that claims to be effective at reducing hair fall and improving hair shine. Ever wondered how the rating of shampoo for hair shine impacts your perception of the shampoo for hair fall control and subsequent decision to purchase? In day-to-day -day purchase instances, customers usually come across situations similar to the one I just mentioned, where they have to choose between multiple products with multiple attributes. In my research, I focus on how customers evaluate different product options that encompass attributes beyond the one they need. To establish the causality of relationships, I conduct a series of experiments examining how the attractiveness of non-focal attributes such as hair shine in the shampoo's case impacts the customer's perception of the shampoo with respect to the focal attribute, which is hair fall control. I also analyze how this impacts the customer's purchase decision. Based on lay theories related to customer perception, I theorize that customers perceive the firms to be resource constrained, and thus they employ zero-sum heuristic during such evaluations. Overall, my work examines the antecedents and consequences of a specialization perception. Further, I also examine the influence of specialization perception at different stages of customer decision making. This research has practical implications. It will provide guidance to marketers and product managers in the initial stages of product development when these professionals encounter challenges related to resource allocation. Thus, it will enable them to strategically distribute resources across various aspects of product to cultivate an increased perception of specialization for the targeted attribute. Thank you.